What's up, my friends? Welcome back to Joy Eats. Today on the menu, we have a Chinese feast. Indeed. Shrimp Szechuan, fried bok choy with garlic, Singapore style noodles, and Cantonese style chow chow mein. So, we're all over the place. Yep. All different types. Szechuan and Cantonese and I don't know what else. And it's all homemade. Yes, indeed. Made by him. Him, truly. <laughs> Oof. So let's dig in. Oh, I'm so like, looking forward to this. I was salivating all the time that I was cooking. So, serve. Serve? Yeah, food is served. Food is served. <laughs> All right. I'm, I'm gonna start with these. They look so good. Mm -mm -mm. And it's even, I even got it crunchy. The noodles. Oh, you did? Yeah, but mm -hmm. they're so stuck underneath the pile of food, we can't get to the darn noodles. It's fine. Mm. Too much food. What are you gonna do? Besides eat. So you got chicken in there, you got... This sauce smells amazing. Shrimp in there. Watercress nut. Is that what it's called? Watercress nut? Watercress. Yeah, watercress nut. Chestnut. Water chestnut. Chestnut what? Isn't it watercress? I don't know. It's got... Baby Shanghai. I don't know, it's not bok choy, it's Shanghai. Snow peas, it's got the noodles, water, chest. Uh, that's a big baby corn. What type of bok choy are these? Look how huge that is! Well, those are still considered baby bok choy. Yeah. Uh, let's see, what else is in there? And a noodle. Cool. I'm excited to eat all this. And the Singapore has got... I don't know, that's not how we use noodle. to do <laughs> <laughs> The chicken and the, 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 the curry sauce. And, and this the, smells good too. It's just... Shrimp, chicken, delicious. chicken breasts. And so this is obviously part of our click your passport because you can't stamp it so might as well click that's good click. I like this click your passport that's a good catchy name are we gonna make like a should we make a playlist click your passport playlist it could be in the title Sounds gonna be in the title. That beautiful chicken. Chicken. Mmm. Yes. It's not even dry. All this team. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. These are really good. I wonder how much is legit. And how much has been Americanified? Americanified? Americanized. Americanized. Yeah. Mer Look how big that piece of chicken is. Americanified. Like Chinese food here back in the day didn't taste like anything that there was in China. Mm.
Chinese food is one of my favorite food to eat too. <laughs> mm. My mom told me mm. a long time ago, she went to a Chinese buffet. Mm -hmm. This is, I don't know how many years ago. And they had hot dogs in like a soy sauce. That's not Chinese food. Back in the day, they used to pass anything off as Chinese food. Yeah. It was a North American version of it. Now, this is the legit stuff, the authenticity. The authenticity, the purity of it all, mm -hmm. the authentic taste. Mm -hmm. Now, it's the authentic stuff. But I just don't know. How authentic, because I've never been to China. My brother went to China. Which one? My oldest one. <laughs> I'm a mess. Oopsies. Mm. This is a little spicy. It's good. It's the shrimps, be. the shrimp are, are beautiful. Did you see how big that is, though? Look how big. <laughs> like the size of my hand, almost. Well. Wow. It's like yeah, one and a half. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, good. They're meaty. I'm gonna give you some. So this is Shanghai, and that's bok choy. And that's the difference in color. <laughs> hey, ooh, ooh, ooh. I can't, ooh, we can't take the, the sauce. We should have had rice. Yeah, we should have put rice. I think we have enough noodles though. <laughs> I really like this one. Mmm. This is good. That's good. Mm. The ginger just, just popping. Just popping popping ginger. Mm. What is this called? Because this is really good. Singapore style noodle. Okay. I like Singapore style noodles. Everything is actually really good. You know it's really good when I start eating with my fingers. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Thank you. My pleasure. Totally. Ish, 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 ish. And it's beautiful how it's all colorful too. Like they do, like in real, in real authentic restaurants. I haven't tried these one yet. The other plate. What is it called? <laughs> Cantonese. Cantonese chow mein. That's what I usually uh, order in restaurants. Cantonese chow mein. Where are we going next? <laughs> I'm not finished eating yet, but where are we going next? I 
I have a request for yes, yes. Philippine. Oh. One Jamaica. Your <laughs> uncle? No, I didn't tell him. I didn't ask him yet. But he won't say no. So, one is Philippine, one is Jamaica. Well, I I, I noted the Every time someone asks for, for like a request, I note it. So you got a list? Yeah, a little list. There's not a lot in it. Mm. So far it's two. So I'll have to check in it, check my list, and we'll see what's next. Someone actually even asked me after the other video, they wanted us to do um, breakfast Lebanese food. So. We might do this too. I also want to do like another Indian mukbang. Mukbang. Indian. So if you guys have requests, just let me know in the comments. And we'll see if we can make them. <clears throat> Italian. Be not bad, mm -hmm. but you know, not just the pizza and spaghetti. I want to do a pizza mukbang too. Yeah, we can just do a pizza all by itself. Yeah, we can do it like a challenge pizza. Like we have to eat like a whole, like like a challenge. Speak to me about this challenge. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see about it. What do you mean? <laughs> you're just you're you're making it up. Yeah. Both challenges, you have to make it, bake it, eat it, all in 45 minutes. No. Okay. We have to bake the other a pizza and they have to eat it. Does that sound good? <laughs> oh my gosh. That's a challenge. <laughs> No, we've got to, you know, we have to try to be honest, mm -hmm. but we iron chef it. How, what is this? What do you mean? We choose an ingredient that we have to use Oh. in our pizza. I get it. And the one that can make the best pizza. Okay. That sounds good. So I brought a, a little pasta spoon. We'll see if it's easier now. Because I couldn't. Okay, yeah, that's better. It's funny how the chicken tastes different in both plates. Even though both are chicken breasts. I love the shrimp in this. This is small. Smells so good. This has a, a strong garlic taste. Does it? Mm hmm. Which is good. I love garlic. I put the garlic towards the end. Mm hmm. That's why.
Wish you guys were eating with us. <laughs> Want more of these ones? Yeah. I love the little touch of sesame on top. Roasted sesame that you did. That's perfect. I'm gonna go bring a spoon for the sauce. Yeah. So saucy. Does it smell like those corn noodles? <laughs> These corn noodles were good. I went to the uh, to the market. Yeah. To pick up some of these. Mhm. Mm like you don't find these everywhere. These are mini corns. Baby corns. Even baby though corn. these are like gigantic babies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyway. Walking through the noodle aisle, mm. it's like a bazillion noodles. Mm -hmm. Who would have thought there was that many different types of noodles? Not me. Wide ones, ribbons. It's, there was Korean ones that were like greenish color, translucent. Really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I've seen. I've been to this market. Uh, just all kinds. Mm -hmm. There's just one section. It's only Japanese noodles. So who would have thought that they had so many different types mm. and they all look the same, packaged the same way? Yeah. But What a feast. So we click China now. We went to China. <sighs> no. China came here. China came here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please thumbs up and subscribe. Definitely subscribe. And hit the bell. My I was waiting for it. <laughs> Ding! And we'll see you guys very soon with another video. I hope you guys stay safe.